and he decided to walk me to the door of the school. I do this six days a week, you know, and, and this is my life now. When I was a young kid, my, my parents decided to send me back to India. They were working and they didn't have the time to raise me at home. Just the discipline that comes from a boarding school in Punjab. It was, it was rough, you know. My name is um, Mansher Kara, and uh, I was born in New York. I started training at a gym in Queens. The minute I started training, I was like, man, I want to compete, you know, I want to, I want to get my, my hands dirty. So I've been competing since I was a white belt, and, you know, I always had success, you know, like local tournaments. My coach kept them promoting me. And then one day I decided that, you know what, I'm going to focus my energy into doing jiu-jitsu and train jiu-jitsu full-time. I've been doing great so far. And when he moved to New York, he decided to open up a school. But I, I, I was very young in jiu-jitsu, and I, I, didn't, I didn't know how much solid I was. First day I trained here, and it was, it was uh, the toughest jiu-jitsu training I've ever done. That was the first time I remember after waking up in the morning and feeling like, oh man, I can't do this again. The biggest tournament I, I won was, you know, um, the Nogi Worlds. And not only did I win my weight class, I also won the Absolute Division, which is, you know, all the weight categories combined together. And zero points were scored only in the Absolute Division, so which is, you know, which is like my favorite thing about the tournament. I finished the division and I'm like, man, I'm not even tired, you know? I really didn't need a sponsor at the time because I had everything going really well for me. But then, you know, I, I started talking more with Azad and, you know, we got more deeper into the meaning of the company Roots. It's more than just a company, you know, it's really personal. And I think, you know, it's very important for me because, you know, growing up in India and coming to Queens, New York, I started losing some of the things. I hang out with Brazilians all day and, and I'm turning more Brazilian, I think, day by day. So. You know, I started losing the connection, so when I talked to him, he kind of inspired me and, you know, he kind of reminded me of, like, where I came from and what I am. And I want everybody throughout the world to understand as well, like, what I represent. I'm very happy to be a part of this team. I never gave up on my, my dream, and my goal is to be the best in the world.